With the line stretching down Michigan Avenue over two hours before first pitch, the Lansing Lubnuts Backyard Baseball theme night was an idea hatched by General Manager Tyler Parsons and his staff, and one that quickly took off. We started looking it up and you know, we Googled Pablo Sanchez and saw his, his card. And on there it says his birthday is 8-18. So we immediately looked at our schedule and saw, hey, we have a game on Saturday, August 18th. What a cool freaking opportunity here to do this. And uh, all the pieces just kind of came together from that point. Since the team announced the night back on July 10th, the Lugnuts made waves that reverberated online and across the country as the Holy Grail, a bobblehead of backyard sports legend Pablo Sanchez, would be the giveaway. From a media and social media standpoint, this has been probably the, the biggest promotion we've ever had in history. You know, the, that bobblehead, I think we, we knew it was going to be big. I don't know if we knew it was going to be this big. And I'll tell you what, I had somebody fly in from Dallas, Texas, because they wanted a Pablo Sanchez bobblehead. We felt that we had something here. And let me go right to Tyler. Tyler knew that he had something, and he had something special here. And so when you've got something special, you share it. The team shared nearly 1,100 bobbleheads with the first fans through the door. But after the giveaway, the game itself featured the Lugnuts wearing new jerseys and sporting a new nickname, one the clubhouse embraced as a trip down memory lane. You know, just come out here today and play like we're playing wiffle ball in the backyard, or, uh, you know, just have a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, you know, it's great memories back when uh, back when I played this game. Oh, you know, I think I think the first game came out maybe 2003 that I remember, and uh, I played it all the time as a kid. It was really the first video game that I ever played. There was, however, some debate as to which nickname the team wanted to become. Yeah, we got the vote too, so it was fun. Uh, everybody tried to vote for a team that the team kind of wanted, and you know, we're. we're really good with the Wombats, you know, we love the, we love the name. The Lugnuts went all out. New scoreboard graphics, a faux 30 for 30 that played pregame, even Pablo himself threw out an honorary first pitch. A lot of people played backyard baseball, a lot of people are down, a lot of people know who the GOAT is, uh, so I think we're all celebrating Pablo Sanchez. The mighty Wombats may have fallen 3-1 to one to the Tin Caps, but for one night only, Lansing baseball fans took a trip down memory lane, and if you missed out, don't fret. There may be another backyard baseball night in the not-too-distant future. There's a very good shot we bring backyard baseball back again next year as well because uh, this has been an awesome success, and uh, we're going to keep building the pile. In Lansing, I'm Jay Sarkar reporting.